What's, What's really, really good? good? It's your boy T Bell. It's your girl Danny DMC. And, and welcome, welcome back, back to TND TV. It's TND. It's TND. It's TND. It's TND. TV. What's good, gang? What's up, you guys? Oh, good morning. I'm still tired. Me too. Me it's too. It's early. It's 8 30. We're up and at them. We ready to get to it. Yes. Man. We're morning people. We love to be up early. Facts, facts, facts. Before we get too deep into this video, make sure you like, subscribe, comment below. Also, turn your post notifications on. Because you want to stay tapped in with the game. game. You feel me? You already know. As you can see from the title below, we are bringing you guys our daily routine. Our couple's routine. Uh, this is this is essential, you know what I'm saying? We got to stay fresh. We are moguls in the making, so, you know what I'm saying? We just got to look good at all times. And it's not just about looking good, but also feeling good and having that time with yourself in the morning. So we definitely wanted to bring you along with us so you can see what we do to prep for our days. I personally wanted to bring you guys a little special razzle-dazzle to the page, you know what I'm saying? On my personal page, I had tried to do a segment called Self Love Saturday. I tried, successfully did. Yeah, I was I was doing a couple segments of it, and um, it, was, it was dope, it was cool, and it was for the fellas, you know, originally, I wanted to show the fellas how to love themselves, but also understand that, you know, whenever you loving someone or you're in a relationship, it starts with you. It starts yeah. with how you treat yourself, in the morning, how you take time to build yourself up before you give your love out to your significant other. And that's so important to have that discussion amongst men because I feel like it's not talked about enough. It's not talked about at all, yeah. honestly. Like, So T-Bell came to me with the great idea to implement this new segment on our channel and we're going to bring Self Love Saturdays over here. Yes, yes, yes. Which is super exciting. We're now going to upload on Saturdays instead of Sundays. We're going to try something different. And I might even try and give you guys double uploads on Saturday because for a lot of our loyal followers and anyone from my confidence crew, you guys know I do double uploads on Sunday. So you get a video on my channel and a video on TND yes, TV. Yes, yes, so we're going to try and move it to Saturdays. So I know you guys are probably wondering why we really want to get into this and implement it on the page. Ultimately, it really just comes down to who we are at the core. You yeah. know what I'm saying? We really empower and uplift others. That's what we stand for, you know, by so many different levels. Yeah, our but career, our personal life. So many different levels. Yeah. So we thought, why not have something on our page that really represents us and talks to the people and helps them, one, gain some information, two, understand why they need to do it, and three, just want to give it back to somebody else around them and tell somebody else about what they learned it. Because we love ourselves so much, we just want to push it back off to the people. Yeah, and I don't think that T-Bell and I would be in the place in our relationship we are if we didn't take time, time yeah. to grow individually and to fill our, our cup up and fill ourselves up with self-love. And I think that's a huge component that's missing from a lot of relationships. People kind of just dive in and then you become so infatuated with another person that you kind of forget about yourself. I can attest to that. Like in college, I used to do that all the time. Like I would yeah. get into a guy and, and then- And lose yourself. And lose yourself. <clears throat> um, and I think it's so important that we change that narrative. And T-Bell and I, like he said, we are all about self-love. We both do a really good job of taking care of ourselves. Mm -hmm. And so we wanna be able to share that with you. So today we're kicking it off by giving you guys our couple's morning routine. This is a video we've been wanting to make for a while, especially yeah. since we live together now. And we have like a solid morning routine. Like I said, we're morning people. So um, I'm excited to bring you guys along with us today. But for Self Love Saturdays, we're gonna have all different types of videos. Um, I'm so excited about it, man. Yeah. We gonna have other couples other videos um, so much like just so much informative information for you guys to think about we might even bring a psychologist on or a therapist or something to just really cool. navigate the space with us and talk about different things because we really want to create a community just based off love and understanding what love is for you yeah because love looks different for everybody a hundred percent and giving you guys resources i think that what makes t-bell and i stand out from a lot of other couples on this platform is that we want you to leave with something you know we obviously we're gonna always give you a good time yeah. you know what i'm saying we you're always gonna do something it's always laugh. gonna be yeah it's always gonna be a good time you're always gonna have yeah. fun you're always gonna enjoy being here and a part of this community but just like on my channel just like on t-bell's channel and all of our other platforms we want you to leave with resources that's so 
important to us individually and as a couple. So we want to be able to put good information out there when we make our videos. So it's always going to be fun. Like I said, always going to be a good time, but you're going to leave feeling like you gained something. And I think that's really important to both of us. Yep, yep, yep. So that being said, we're going to kick off our couple's morning routine. And so cute. <laughs> that being said. Okay. Mm, Not kiss. Kiss Give me a normal kiss. Mating call. Give me a kiss. <laughs> That's how you get the kiss. So annoying. Like alpha female. <laughs> So to kickstart our day, we normally wake up, get a little cuddle in like you just saw a second ago. Uh, I normally make the bed because I'm usually out the bed last. We got a rule like whoever gets out the bed yeah. last makes the bed. I'm an, I'm the early, early bird. We usually wake up like 7.38. Yeah. As you guys can see, we have separate bathrooms. So that is a perk in itself. Yeah, because we, we can really take, enjoy that. Yeah, we can take our time to ourselves and just take our time. I yeah. Take a long boo-boo if I need to, you know All what I'm right. saying? Brush my teeth however long I need. And that is really time to get to myself. Yeah, it's really nice for us to have that time in the morning. Obviously, you know, we get a little cuddling in the morning, we connect, but then it's nice to have time alone to really just connect with ourselves and kind of get grounded for the day before we then come back together. I think us having separate bathrooms is like one of the nicest things because it gives us time to fill ourselves up first. And that's like what we were just talking about. Like you have to fill yourself up first before then you can show up for someone else. Yeah. 100%, so we 100%. love to do that. We, and we take our times in the morning um, and, you know, we'll go in each other's bathrooms, <laughs> T-Bell, steal a little cuddle. You know what I'm saying? I just be grabbing cheeks. I ain't gonna hold. <laughs> you really do. Yeah. You ready to get to this workout? Yes. So now we're about to get on our workout flow. We've been really on it lately and it's really nice for us to go to the gym together. You know, you'll see. We do our little own separate thing and then we come together, attack. And then we're gonna show you, after the gym, we're gonna show you the rest of our morning routine and what we do to prep for our days. So. Let's get it, y'all. Wait no more, let's get it. Okay, y'all, we're officially ready for the gym. We gotta do a little OTD. My um, bra top is from Amazon. Babe, where you at? I'm watching. You're sexy, so. <laughs> My um, bra is from Amazon. These shorts are from this Australian brand, LSKD. I'm obsessed with them. They fit so good, they're so comfortable. Then I have um, some Nike workout shoes on. I love these shoes so much. They're amazing for working out. And that's it, you know, baddie by me. And you got your man. I do. Oh, you got okay. your man right here. Just get my fit. I'm just team jump man all the way down. Always. You look good. You ready to get this work in? I get it. Let's get it. Okay, you guys, we just got to the gym. Luckily at our building, the gym is so incredibly nice. And they have a ton of stuff outside. So they have bikes. They have ellipticals, they have treadmills. One of the treadmills is down right now and there's someone else on the treadmill. Normally I've been doing the 12, 330, but you know, adjusted for my body. So I've been doing 10, 320 um, and it's been feeling so good, but I can't, you know, Debo the treadmill from her. So I'm gonna go on the elliptical and try and get just as much work in. That's my warm up. Ty does another warm up, and then you'll see we get back together and put that work in together. All right, you guys, I just finished doing oh, a 10 for 20 on the elliptical. I am dewy and sweaty and exhausted. It's also my time of the month. Give me my kudos in the comments below, okay? Because working out during that time, is a struggle for me. But let's go find T-Bell, get a little strength training in. Found you. You ready to do some stuff together? Yeah. Okay, let's get it. Gotta look good. It's the sweat over the lip for me, that. Even when you sweat, you look sexy. I get it.
Hey guys, just left the gym, feeling nice and rejuvenated and refreshed. You want a smoothie? Man, you got me. I mean, I'm, I could go for one. We right both now. make really good smoothies. I need extra honey. In the this problem one. is that, yeah, Ty likes his so sweet. One, I, I don't like sweetness in my smoothie. And he likes to put, like, a lot of times when he's been making his smoothies now, he puts, like, creatine. Is that what it's called? I won't put none of that like stuff. Like, weight gain stuff. No, I'm going to make it today. No, no, I, like, you don't need to. No, I want to. Okay. Because I'm going to make it better. And There's I'm no like, competition, but yours are usually better. Period. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna put you on today and show you how I make my smoothies, okay? This is a secret recipe. Uh -huh. I'm giving you all the goods today. So, lately I've been loving these um, Blendtopia Superfood Smoothie Kits from Whole Foods. They're a little expensive, they're like $5 per container, but there's so many good things in them. This is the detox one. So it has pineapple, celery, bananas, kale, spinach, lemon, and cayenne. It also has hemp seeds, wheatgrass, flax seeds, and chlorella. So there's a lot of goodness in there. And I start with that and make that like the base of the smoothie. And then I add so many things. Okay, now I'm putting in a banana. I love bananas so much. Okay, then protein powder. This is my favorite vegan protein powder. 21 grams of pro plant protein, five grams of fiber, no sugar. It's the vanilla bean. So I do one scoop of that, like a heaping scoop. Ooh, I can cut the strawberries. You already cut the strawberries? No, yes. Okay, then while we're waiting for the strawberries, he going to cut those things up. I'm gonna put a scoop of bee pollen, a scoop of chia seeds. Even though this mix already has chia seeds, I want more. And a scoop of maca powder. Okay, now I do a scoop of the Justin's vanilla almond butter. I love this. I always need some type of peanut butter in his smoothie. I don't always need it, but it is a good little addition. I'm a peanut butter lover. <laughs> also, I would just like to give you a disclaimer that we both wash our hands thoroughly after the gym. Okay, now we go in with the Chobani oat milk. This is my favorite. It has no sugar in it, which is so hard to find with oat milk. And I put a good amount of this because I like it to not be too thick. Not the Chobani. And then I'm also, my secret ingredient uh -oh. is water. Like if you go to any smoothie place, you'll always see they put water in their smoothies that's to make them. Cheat, no, that's not true, babe. Yes, it is. Okay, maybe, but also it makes them more um, runny, like in a good way. So I'm gonna do that. Just a little bit, not too much. And you'll see it's gonna come out to perfection. Ready? Mason jar. Second mason jar. It's good. You like it? I love it. Mm -hmm. I love you wanna it. go to the roof? All right, we'll catch you guys on the roof. All right, right now we're getting a good stretch in. It's a nice cool down. We got our smoothies, sipping those. Now we're just gonna start with our feet, roll our feet out. You wanna hold me, dude? Yeah, you know me. What that feel like? Pain. Stretching is so important. That's I feel like it's something Ty always tells to people, especially like clients of his or people that he works out with or hoops with. And it's something that I need to implement. I feel like I've heard him say it so much, but I'm not as good at it. Like I'll get my workout in, I'll get that work in, but really taking the time to stretch is so important and I need to do it more. For sure, for sure. And a lot of people definitely skip past their feet. You gotta understand yeah. that your feet are muscle and they have tendons just like the rest of your body. So it's important that you make sure that those get stretched out after workouts as well. Just a, It's just a spot we neglect normally. So, gotta touch that up.
Just went and got my incense holder. Y'all ain't got one of these? We love that incense holder. Y'all gotta get one. Tap in with my boy, Mr. Valentino. I'll be posting them on my Instagram. We love our incense in this household. We love our home to smell good and fresh and I don't know, incense does something, especially when you get the right ones. But how do you get your hips down? Like, I need to work on more biomechanical movements to like open up my hips. Yeah, do you do like these? What is that? Like when I was a dancer, we used to have to like put our elbows into our knees. Yeah, push down. I'm gonna put some music, speed this up, put some music on for you guys because we're about to get into our zone. Can you put some music on for real? Yeah. Like water sounds or? Yeah, uh, let me see how you do. You know what I'm gonna put on. All right, you guys, when we get done with stretching and meditating, we're usually in a calm type trance, and we like to read our books in our cozy spots. As you can see, Danny's in her favorite chair reading and journaling, and I am in my favorite chair reading an article. All right, you guys, so you have seen our couple's morning routine, and Ooh. we are all calm and peace and tranquil. I think we're gonna go take a dip in the pool. You trying to hit the pool? Yes, a little dip in a hot tub. All right. Then we're gonna shower and get our day started. But I hope you guys enjoyed seeing our routine and how grounded and centered we like to get and how we spend like equal parts alone and together in the morning yeah. so that we can like connect with ourselves and then connect together as a couple. I think that's super important. Definitely so important. Had a great morning, babe. Me I really, too. really enjoyed working out with you and the reading session is always, I know, I love reading. I'm reading such a good book. I'm reading Children of Virtue and Vengeance, the series. It's the second book in the series um, by Tomi Yemi. I think that's how you say it. Oh, so good. Phenomenal. Yeah, and I was reading the Motivation Manifesto. Hope you guys really enjoyed this first segment of Self Love Saturday. Um, I really enjoyed you a lot. And I appreciate you for coming along this journey with me yes we're really excited to introduce this new segment to you guys so get ready for self-love saturdays we got some more fire so ones much coming. more to come so much more to come yes we're gonna keep it rolling so like usual make sure you like subscribe comment below also turn on post notifications on because you, you want to stay, stay tapped in with the game you, you already know what to do you guys we're gonna go enjoy the rest of our day i hope you do the same we love you and we'll see you soon peace, peace.